What's up, boys? So the Apex Legends mobile closed betas are almost finished. So the next question is, when is global? We're going to be taking a look at it today as well as some other news regarding the game. But mark my words, boys. When Apex Mobile comes out... Go to your phone. Delete every single other game on your phone. Call of Duty Mobile. Pfft. PUBG Mobile. Boring. Animal Crossing Pocket Camp. Ah, oh, all right, we'll allow that one. And without further ado, let's get into it. Let's go. Now, before we start, boys, I want you all to go into the comments right now. Click on the Twitter link in the comments, like and retweet that tweet, plus tag EA and Respawn to give us the trailer for Apex Legends Mobile. Go and do that right now before you watch. Okay, so let's talk about the future of Apex Legends Mobile. As you guys already know, the closed beta is in full swing in India and the Philippines, and honestly, my thoughts on it are, are pretty good. Aside from the obviously the minor bugs and the kinks, it actually runs smooth and the graphics look insane for a mobile game. It's very vibrant, the map textures, the colors look good, all the legends and the weapons feel amazing to use. A lot of you guys have actually been talking down about the game because of the bugs that are currently in it, but listen guys, it's a closed beta. Closed betas are here to release and test out the game way before it's released globally and Already confirmed by EA in their last press conference, they stated that there also are going to be open betas and a soft launch before the global release comes at the end of this year. Have a watch at this video quickly. And that's why we're confident in uh, projecting future growth around both the existing business and, of course, um, Apex Mobile. Um, and what we've talked about is, uh, you know, releasing or soft launching Apex Mobile later this year, um, as is the nature of mobile games. Uh, we have a series of closed beta tests, open beta tests, and then soft launches to ensure we're appropriately tuning the metrics. Um, we've not got big numbers in our plan this year for it. Blake can comment more on that. Um, but what we've really done is apply the same orientation the team has had around the core franchise, which is let's make sure we get the gameplay right, let's make sure we get the event strategy around the gameplay right, and let's make sure we're listening to players and delivering on what players want out of that experience. That has grown every meaningful metric of Apex uh, Legends every single season since launch. And our expectation is that we'll also be able to grow that in the same way. Stop launch this month. Yeah, and we've, uh, we've this put, uh, rel as I think Andrew mentioned in his, his prepared remarks, we put relatively little uh, revenue in for Apex Mobile in this coming year. Because you don't know exactly when you will release a mobile game. You want to make sure you test it. Uh, tune it, and then release it at the right time. And that's globally, including China. Um, uh, we believe there are some huge markets for Apex Mobile. As Andrew also mentioned, Japan is one of our largest markets for the console and PC game um, and the Switch game. And so we believe it will be a huge market for mobile. So we'll prioritize some of those markets. But... We also know people love the game all around the world. So more to come on that. Um, I would just trust that we have not put a large number in our forecast for Apex Mobile yet because of some up. of those unknowns. Support them. And, yeah, so guys, um, you know, what this is that year is confirmed for the a, soft launch. So that soft launch is global, by the way. You know, I think so that's insane. And they're reaching to go to China as well. well. And the Chinese uh, regulations are super hard to get a game over there. So they must already have a strap to get over there. Thank you. So, but the more we support the game... But think about it, right? Don't think about it. What we're in now, we're in May. So we're almost halfway through the year, okay? They said the global's coming out towards the end of the year. So we've got the closed betas that are happening right now, Philippines and India. We've got the open betas next, which will probably be next month or in two months from now. Then the soft launch in two to three months. And then the global launch as well. So soft launch will be here by like August. So there, guys, you can hear that the CEO, Andrew Wilson, confirmed that the global version of Apex will be releasing towards the back end of this year. So anywhere from October to December. 
Bear in mind, guys, what they have shown us in the sort of closed beta so far only included the map World's Edge and also only sort of a few selected legends. Uh, but rest assured, they have probably developed uh, a lot more that they have shown us yet. A few mods of mine actually data mined the closed beta files and found some pretty incredible things that I can't discuss on this video, unfortunately, but just know that the, the stuff that Apex and Respawn are going to be involving in the, in the sort of global release is amazing so just stay tuned for that now i want to obviously go back to the closed beta because if you guys didn't already know it was capped at 30 fps and it was capped at very low to low settings so please don't expect obviously the finished product to look like that as it will most likely run at 120 fps with very high graphical so the maps the textures will look a hell of a lot better as well as the smoothness of the gameplay now if you guys didn't know i've been making basically apex legends mobile videos for the past 10 months i've pretty much converted my whole channel into apex legends mobile and i've been making a lot of predictions for a while now that have all pretty much came true so although these are not confirmed they are the closest educated guess based on research that i've done so i made this timeline back at the end of february with my predictions predictions for this year and so far I predicted that the closed beta would come before the end of May which it has so the next prediction now is for respawn to release a trailer for the game since you guys already know PUBG new states they haven't even released a closed beta yet and they've already released a trailer for the game which is insane um it would only make sense obviously for respawn to start hyping apex mobile up a bit more from now on next obviously will be the open betas in certain countries like canada and australia and maybe some other countries so respawn can basically test the servers Following that, guys, you already know that Tencent are helping Respawn with Apex Legends Mobile, and they have their annual game show in June, so we may obviously see some updated gameplay and some updated graphics then, maybe some, you know, 60 FPS and above. Now, since the devs have already said that the global launch will be towards the back end of this year, typically when a soft launch releases for a mobile game, it comes out sort of three to four months prior to the global version to give enough time to prepare and to fix and gain enough feedback from the players as well so if my calculations are correct we are going to get the soft launch which is basically the global launch of the game available only in certain countries and not on the app store we're going to get it around sort of july time so then we have obviously from july august september october until the global version comes i've obviously mentioned this timeline a, a, a few times to you guys but obviously this is for you guys that have missed my last video so this is basically like i said an updated timeline just to show you some sort of predictions i have again i've predicted correct the uh the closed beta so far so Take my word for it or don't take my word for it. Let me know in the comments what you guys think. And so far, that's basically all we have regarding Apex Legends Mobile. I'm going to be releasing a lot more videos. I've still got loads of content from the closed beta I'm going to be releasing to you guys. But obviously, take this video to have a, a sort of rough estimate in your head of when the global version is going to come. Remember, guys, it's going to come this year before the end of the year. So just get hyped for it. Obviously, don't forget to hit a like and subscribe to keep up with anything Apex, Med Apex Legends Mobile related and i will catch you guys in the next one a lot more juicy content to come so again this channel is going to blow up absolutely blow up when apex comes i'm so hyped for it i'm so hyped to show you all the content for apex mobile i love apex legends i play that quite a lot on pc um, but that's the end of the video guys so thank you for watching hit a like and subscribe and i'll catch you in the next one peace